Next is some Juan Unda. And the subject is CM Punk, aka Bret Hart 2.0. This is inter- interesting email. So the one it's on. It's on. The, is, it's on the nose. It really is. Dear K100 crew, I've heard you fellows and other podcasters talk about CM Punk's AEW booking. Punk admitted that he's a Bret Hart mark, a big Bret Hart mark, and that his match with Darby was modeled after Bret Hart's Bret's Raw match against the One Two Three Kid. What do you think of Punk taking his time to a main event? Is this Bret Hart work with every one of the card methods something that could still work today? Uh, so the Jersey Reek and one Unda. I will say this. I don't think Punk should have ever admitted. Okay, bro, when you say you're a, you're, you're a Bret Hart mark and his match with Darby was, was modeled after Bret's match against the one two three kid and bro, bro, you're you're literally repeating the exact same spots in the match. Yeah. <sighs> That's like, <laughs> I, I don't I don't know if like honestly, it's like if, if I'm a worker, I want to say, yeah, I'm just copy I'm just cosplaying other matches. I'm just copying other guys. That's not that's not like the best thing to say. Like if, if you find out punk is all, all punk is doing is just, just it's not like he's not really creative. He just goes and he just writes down a bunch of spots that other guys do and just, just and just does that. Would be an interesting way to, to, to look at him going forward. If that's if that's the way he's he's doing this, which which honestly, there's nothing wrong with that. Because, you know, if nobody knows, you could just copy everything. Bits and pieces here and there, which which is basically all wrestlers do. But you never like admit that, like, well, I just did the Bret Hart versus One Two Three Kid match. It's like, okay, well, you, so you didn't come up with it yourself. It's like, you just you could do that. Well, I think it, you could I find a match and just look copy at it. it as, go ahead. As him paying homage to a great match. This I'm True. respecting it by recreating it. You know, so. right? But I would be interested to say, I, 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 you know what I may do? I'm, I'm going to watch both of those matches. I want to see how much he he did verbatim. Yeah, like how much the, of that uh, match was verbatim. That that you know, the so, opening so, spot so. was 100. percent uh, a, a homage. He they did a, right. a quick arm yeah, that, drag. That, that's, arm you got to remember yeah. that's a that's that's from twenty five years ago or thirty. Right. You know so nobody would know. I mean, that, that, right. That's my whole point. Like nobody, you could do that all you want. Yeah. But saying that out loud is, is all I'm saying. Is that it's kind of <laughs> that's like, yeah. I just right. I wouldn't disco, say that out loud. Trust me. Right. That fan base knew. They knew that right. he was doing that. He didn't have to say it. You know.